There's a new game that's sweeping the hardcore world, but why? Let's take a look at desert golfing. So it's decidedly super simple, kind of a trajectory velocity game um, from Justin Smith, aka Captain Games, and it's taking off a lot. Your thoughts, Malik? I'm sorry, I'm playing desert golf right now. Yeah, Don't I'm golfing. playing right now. I'm just playing. <laughs> <laughs> like I guess this is just once again like that really simplified game that just catches on and gets popular. Very this is simple swinging this, mechanics. This is Flappy Bird all over again. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, and. You know what, it's, it's actually has like, many of these mobile games mm -hmm. are addictive. A lot of these games are made and they're addictive. It's just all about having like that niche, that thing that makes you stand out above everything else. And this one just happens to be that it's ridiculously simple. And there's no end. Yeah, there's no end. There's no mulligans, it's, you just, if you mess up, you start over. Right. Very high stroke count for golf. It's, it's bare bones. It's yeah, bare bones. Yeah, I guess it's, that's it. It's it's so simple. Yeah, I think people I, people like that. They like the bare bones stuff. You know, uh, this is kind of like you know the hipster game. You yeah. know, if you're if you're if you want to if you want to play a game that's like. If you're a hipster, the way you're going to describe this game is like, you know what? There's this game. It's like super simple, but it's way more addictive than all that stuff they put all the money into that's on the mainstream. And uh -huh. you like show your friends that game, and it's a craze. Well, it looks like a very simple Angry Birds, or I've heard Bang Bang. Yeah, Bang Bang is a good Missile one. Missile defense, like yeah, yeah, all those tra tra trajectory-based games where you have yeah. to kind of aim things right and calculate like the angles correctly so you can succeed. It's basically the same thing. That's all it is. Sure. Yeah. And I mean, that's th that type of stuff is addictive. It's like, you know, you're having like these little mini math sessions right here in your hand and you strive to get each one of them right because, I mean, problem solving is a thing that us humans do. And once you do it, once you solve a problem, you feel a sense of accomplishment. As long as that's there, people are going to play this game. Is it that kind of heightened game or is it just simply another flappy bird, which I also did not really catch on myself. Yeah, I mean, it's it's another Flappy Bird. But Flappy Bird had a sense of accomplishment. Once you beat your high score, you're like, oh, I want to go back in and see if I can beat that. And then you and your friends would be bragging to each other over who had the highest score. So. And it's interesting how simple it is. There's no, like, you know, you're not shamed for doing poorly. You don't really have, like, oh, I have to beat these 10 levels and then I'm, I'm done or I move on to this thing. It just, just goes mm -hmm. on and on and on. Is that... Is that something that people crave? I, I think people definitely crave that. They people love simplicity. Like uh, if things are accessible and easy for me to just like pop into and do something, get a sense of you know accomplishment, get out. I'm all for it. Simple as that. I'm just waiting for like the you know the shit ton of clones of desert golf that we're going to see hit the Android and iPhone market because it's gonna happen. There's gonna be a shit ton ton of clones uh -huh. that want to do. There always is. Golf. Yeah, always. And then, and so wait, then we'll bring up that question of plagiarism. And then what has desert golf thing been like? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Desert golf two Vizinga or no it won't even be called desert it'd be called like hot sands King will golf. just rip it off and call it uh, turtle saga five <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah something yeah. like that as, I don't know as long as they don't try to you know copyright and patent the word uh, desert then desert cool. golfing saga <laughs> <sighs> all right so I'm wondering do you like desert golfing and what is your appeal what what it what draws you to it it seems to have swept over as a craze for a lot of people. Let us know what you think below in the comments, and please be sure to subscribe.